Access granted. Today is my 100th video, year 100th video, and to celebrate this moment, let's see what video I have to choose. Let's see what I've got for my 100th video. Ocean sunfish, bone, the world's largest bony fish, full of bones. This creature weighs more than a freaking truck. Let's see a short video related to this. Ocean sunfish, known as Mola Mola, are the heaviest bony fish in the world. They can weigh up to 2 tons and grow up to 10 feet long. They use their fins alone to slowly move across the ocean. They prey on jellyfish and other gelatinous raw plankton like squid and fish. Some fish love to sunbathe to warm up themselves when they are not looking for food. Sunbathing at water level. Sunbathing at water level. Oh. The larvae looks much different from their adult form. With only 2.5 millimeters in length. There's also, and what I've researched just that there's also myths related to ocean sunfish that are eating them as well. Bad luck, do not ever eat them, even if you are a non witch. Uh, and I don't know whether it is like this truth is dumped or not, so I gotta leave it there only. Goblin shark. Wait a second, this kind of represents someone from Goblin Kringles. Wait, I've gotta see this. I've gotta see this. I'm gonna search this. Oh, it's just, it looks resembles the same though. Not perfectly 100%, but it resembles the same. Yeah, Harry Potter's character Goblin Gringotts. Look at this. Isn't this. Doesn't this look a bit similar to you? I think it's a bit similar for me. The Goblin Shark. The goblin shark is really one of the most freaky deep sea sharks there is. I mean, it looks like a goblin, it looks like a monster, that's how it got its name. It has the ability to distend its jaw way out in front of its body and then snap it back to catch food. Goblin shark is found in the Indian Ocean, Pacific Ocean and Atlantic Ocean and it's mainly found in the coastal areas, obviously. These are, all, these are sea creatures. Obviously, you you aren't gonna find shark on some plane or mountain. You're gonna find it here only. Oh my god! I wouldn't go, wanna go near this thing for fuck's sake, man. It is named Tenguzen, which means shark in Japanese. Duncan Frogmouth. Now, first of all, first of all, it's not what it looks like. You might think that this looks like an owl, but it is actually not an owl. It is a bird. Yeah, it's a bird. The eyes, the beak, as you can see this, the skin, all these represents an owl's image, but as you know that... So deceptive. Yeah, the two replies here. Yeah, the left one is the female one and the male is the right one here, as you can see in this image. Let's see the short video on this also. laying one single egg and taking care of it it's their job and obviously all birds do their job laying egg taking care of their small ones that's all they do job owls actually look scary i don't know why uh, only i think so or the way they look or they kind of see or the way they kind of see us at night it's uh fucking creepy i think it's a bit creepy the way they look i don't know why is it just me or anyone else thinks the same Oh my fucking god. I'm gonna throw up. I'm gonna throw up seeing this. Oh, I can't see this. Looks like porcupine with all those spines like things. But the black and white color, it represents the panda one. Yeah. This is not only... And again, the same theory applies here. This is not what it looks like. It's not an ant. It's not an ant, it's a wasp. 
<laughs> I don't know why this looks like an ant to be honest. Maybe the world has got some real surprises for us. Don't you agree? The world has got some real surprises for us. I'm gonna stay away from this though. I don't want to come near this. Kind of looks very scary though. It's a lot smaller than us humans. I love it, guys. They're especially like cuter. This cute creature, this cute creature is eyes in Bay of Bengal, Bay of Bengal and Southeast Asia, which includes our country also. But there, but there's a bad news associated with this creature. It is actually in danger, and because there are, I've researched this, and it is said that. There are only around 7,000 left, only around 7,000 in the world. That's not even 1% if we count the whole world. My goodness, it looks like the tigers in India. And well now, I don't know I gotta say much in this, but I've just showed that this creature has got some really different sort of cry. So let's see this cry, hear this cry. Wait, what the fuck? Is this school? It has got its moment, we can't do anything about it. That's the time of my watch. And that means my show is over and I'm gonna see you the next time. So take care of yourself guys and so long. Bye.